What's going on here? Well, <laughs> so I'm sorry. I didn't really text you the info. Like Rosenberg just called me as he sometimes does. Like he just calls me to be on a show and like ask a question or whatever. But they're just like in a in the midst of a conversation about the ringer wrestling show and the ringers thing with WWE. And why are you listening to him? Why do you trust him? Like what makes you think he doesn't have some hidden agenda? <laughs> well, I think Rosenberg always has a hidden agenda. I mean, yeah, it's, not... it's an open agenda. The open you're, agenda you're is right. what he, the people he wears, are he wears, he wears a jacket with his name in sequence on it. So the agenda is not hidden. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, it's right there in sequence. <laughs> um, no, I mean, yeah, I think he probably does. I think he probably, I mean, to be honest, I don't even, this is probably isn't even going to be on, on the podcast but to be honest i think that he probably you know he he he, he saw the what we're doing and he's just like jealous and he wants to he wants to you know be a part of it he went he's like that's i should have gotten that gig and now he's no no, try to no 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 bill that that's uh, let me just speak for myself for one moment if i can we received a, a letter from an, a, a pecker in the cheap heat universe who said have you have you reached out to shoemaker about the possibility of cheap heat and the ringer I thought it was logical, and I said, rather than have awkward conversations off the air, let's have the awkward conversation on the air as a great is radio this, host. Is this like a Marty Jannetty type thing? Like, what what's happening? So, well, if Marty Jannetty had just asked Shawn Michaels, hey, can we get can, together and can, do a tag can team? I, can I be in DX? I see what you're doing with DX. Yes, right. <laughs> right. Is if Marty Jannetty came to Shawn Michaels and was like, hey, I see you with your new friends. I'd like to join. That's what's happening here, Bill. What's I can't. I can't stay in my angry character anymore. I tried. I'm having too good of a time. Um, <laughs> no, it's it's good to see you guys again. How? Um, first of all, congrats on everything. Thank and, you. And serious question: Is there a way Cheap Heat and the Ringer could happen? Because I am. We are free at Cheap Heat to go wherever. And I'm watching what you guys are doing. And now this is, I've been asked in person a few times when we were in Vegas, SGG, people asked about this. Yep. And now people are asking in the, in the mailbag. So we just wanted to ask you guys directly, can there be a cheap heat ringer, shoemaker, Rosenberg, stack guy, Greg reunion? Is this possible? How, I, I have a couple questions. Okay. How do I know you're not CM punking us? <laughs> that you're just dowling, you're flirting. You know, I might come back. You just like the attention that you might come back. You like mm. the people wondering on the weird message boards, could the cheap heat reunion happen? And you're just basically pouring the gasoline on the flames with no intention of actually having the reunion. Is this legitimate? Is my first question. So here's how you know. Because the ball has been placed in your court. That's right. It's up wow. to you to give it the thumbs up or the thumbs down. It's as legit as you make it right now. Because the, the thing is, the comparison, CM Punk, in theory, if he was having a conversation with WWE and a conversation with AEW, there were these two legitimate entities competing for him. I would argue that if the ringer Spotify is WWE, I, I don't know that there is an AEW to your WWE. Where, where, are we, where, where are we going? Bleacher Report? I, I don't know where the place is. This is, this is the place. So it's kind well, of here or like go to Ring of Honor, which I don't want to do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, man, you think back... Funny. The lineage of the cheap heat pod, which goes back to the Grantland days, way back when. Mm -hmm. A place near and dear to all of our hearts. Yeah. The opportunity to reunite on the ringer and Spotify, I think, is too tasted to pass up. You have a deal. Dipper Steve, can you make this happen? Wow. I think we can work something out. You can work something out? Great. <laughs> So I, we have to figure out what this would look like. I have no idea, but you think we could? This is a real possible thing to go back to the Grantland days of Shoemaker, Rosenberg, SGG, the squad all coming together. Wow. Cheap Heat comes to the ringer. I think I'm in. Is Shoemaker in? What does Shoemaker say? I'm busy, but I can I can make time for <laughs> I can make time for that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Wow. Well, I'm, in, I, I, I'm in a dip. Uh, can you have your office reach out to uh, Bill Simmons' office? I'm going to end this right now. We're going to circle yeah, let's back. Run away with this, yes. Yeah, you could Let's circle back. This, yes, I'm gonna circle no, back. Bill, right. no, uh, Bill, no take backs. I'll await your circling. <laughs> <laughs> we're circling and circling. All right, we're circling and circling, guys. Uh, thank you for making time. I'll, I'll, I'll text you both. All right, it was my okay. pleasure. Good to see you. Guys.